again. Sue and Carl have been friends since college, so they're used to traveling together. Notice how she lets Carl take her arm, holding it just above the elbow. That way, Carl can follow the motion of her body and sense when she makes a turn or comes to a sudden stop. Unfortunately, a lot of well-meaning people try to take the blind person by the arm. It may seem only natural, but it just isn't right. How about the John Wayne? Remember, let the blind person take your arm. Sounds like a good idea to me. Also, notice how Sue walks about a half step ahead of Carl, all the time being careful to let him know what's ahead. Their first stop. Sue turns, slowly but naturally, towards the door. Here she gives Carl an important verbal cue. The door opens towards you to the right. After that, it's as simple as walking through a doorway. Once inside a store, or any place unfamiliar to the blind person, it's always good to explain a little about the place. How's the store set up? What are the aisles like? Are they wide or narrow? Are there stairs, or is it all on one level? That way, the blind person can begin to form a mental impression of his surroundings. Could you tell me where the men's department is? Yes, it's just on the second floor. Thank you. 